Hi, my name's Leah, and I decided to hike the PCT in 2019. Um, yeah, right now I hate my job, and uh, I decided it was time for a career change. So, uh, I uh, realized they were uh, still had some permits they were given out on January 15th. And I think I decided about this about January 9th. I just looked it up on the PCT organization page and thought, you know, what the heck? Um, if I can get a, a date, get a pass to go somewhere in March and April I'm just gonna go for it I'm gonna quit my job and I'm just gonna do this so yeah I got a date for March 28th uh, it, you know I haven't got the permit yet it's still pending but I don't know why it wouldn't go through so I went out on a limb and I quit my job so that's that and uh, pretty big decision for me, um, I'm basically giving up my career to go hiking for six months and then I uh, have to figure out what I'm going to do when I get back. So, super excited, super scared, uh, I'm going through a lot of emotions. Uh, I was planning on doing this in 2020, so I started hiking actually about a year ago. And other than a couple hikes I did in my early 20s, I really didn't hike until this last year. Found that I really loved it, and I did over 50 hikes, uh, mostly in the Olympic National Park and Olympic National Forest in Washington over the last year, uh, mainly day hikes. I have done a couple overnighters, but you know, I, I'm still a newbie at this, so. Uh, I have a lot of fears, but I'm pretty determined, and I'm just going to go for it. So, I have a lot to do. I'm a little overwhelmed. I have a little over two months. I don't have, uh, I have maybe two, three items a year that's actually going to work for this hike. So, I've, uh, the last couple nights been working on, uh, uh, PCT planner I think it's Craig's PCT planner so I have that kind of mapped out start working on resupplies and I've made a gear list and I've been researching stuff for about for the last year um, but I'm kind of nailing it down to what I think I want um, because I don't want to pack a whole bunch of weight you know so I really need to go ultra light uh, I'm old 52 and uh, slightly overweight and yeah so I don't want to pack 35 40 pounds uh, so I posted on Facebook the other night uh, about my getting my permit and I was really surprised that I actually got a lot of support already from family and friends uh, lots of emotional support uh, questions and concerns it's actually pretty funny. I talked to my sister last night, and she had some questions for me. Um, one of, you know, kind of about, you know, are you going to be hiking some elevation? Are you going to do some mountains? I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm going to be going over a couple mountains, you know. And I mount, mentioned Mount Whitney, and she asked me what the elevation was. I'm like, I don't know. I think it's like 13,000 feet. She was concerned because she gets altitude sickness, so she was telling me her experience with that. And then uh, she's like, "Wow," uh, she's like, "You don't still smoke, do you?" And I'm like, "Actually, yep, still smoking." So uh, yeah, she was concerned about me trying to climb a mountain when I still smoke. You know, so maybe uh, I'm not worried. I've been smoking. The whole last year when I hiked, I typically don't smoke the whole time I'm hiking, but it's kind of my reward when I get done. But who knows? Maybe I'll quit smoking on the trail, but not to start with. You know, figuring I get somewhere out there where I can't go to town for three, four days might be a good time to try when I don't have access to cigarettes. So that's one of my goals on the trail, maybe is to be uh, 
a non-smoker by the time I get done. So anyway, I, uh, I've also reached out to people on, oh, I joined a Facebook group uh, for a PCT class of 2019, and uh, I just kind of put, threw it out there, you know, that I'm uh, new at this, I still have a lot of questions, I'm pretty resourceful, but there's, you know, there's a lot to learn still, and uh, I got a lot of good responses and feedback from people, and found a number of people that are starting around the time that I am, that, uh, you know, be willing to hike some miles with me, which is great. You know, I, uh, I just, one of my fears is hiking alone. And, uh, you know, I've done it. I've been forcing myself to do it um, at times here, but uh, it's still scary to me. You know, I, sometimes I'm fine and other times I, I get really panicky. So just the fact that there's going to be other people out there is, is comforting to me. And, you know, I know I'm willing to face all my fears along the way. So anyway, I just wanted to introduce myself. I've been doing some YouTube videos for a while. I still suck at it, but, you know, I'm, I'm learning. I'm getting some new equipment here shortly. And uh, so I'm going to have to learn how to use all that and how to edit on my phone uh, before I go. So that's one of the areas I need to work on. and. Uh, just, I, I still have a month of work left, and I, you know, have a lot to prepare for this trip as far as training goes. Uh, I haven't done a lot of hiking in the last couple months. It's cold and wet and crappy out here in Washington, so, uh, but I'm going to have to get out there and do it. I have hiked the last couple weekends, though, but I just, I need to start increasing my miles and get in shape before I go and start testing out gear as I get it to make sure you know everything's gonna work for me and it's comfortable and um, I don't want to get out there and find that you know I got the wrong gear so anyway I look forward to meeting all of you and uh, for my family and friends and anybody that's interested and wants to follow my journey I plan on uh, vlogging and ho hopefully at least once a week maybe more often and then play it by ear I, I guess it, it depends on how time-consuming it's going to be and and uh, my access to internet to be able to upload videos but uh, if you're interested in following me I uh, have a YouTube channel called Grandma Leah and I will be uh, posting videos on it regularly uh, please subscribe to my channel if you'd like to follow. It's free. You just hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell, and that way you'll know when I've uploaded a new video. I look forward to uh, taking this journey with all of you, and I appreciate all your support. Thank you.